Hey guys, Dan Hood, Big DH2000 here. A little bit different scenery behind me today. Sometime back, Michael contacted me, uh, sent me a couple of cores and some material he wanted attached to them and a custom made out of them. So, first one's finished here. Um, you'll recognize the bean flip. Okay, I believe Simple Shop made the core and Michael picked it up and then we got black and gray G10 scales okay set back a little bit um, I put in the black plugs uh, this is a little bit of a bit of a beast to sand but you guys have seen my uh, making and sanding video so you know how I did that put a lanyard on it don't know if Michael will want it Hold it like this. Feels nice and comfortable. You can also brace it if you want. There's, you can, this is just right for either bracing or holding around it. Okay. And I think Simple Shot leaves the slots in it. Uh, I, it came with slots. I guess that's in case you don't want to use the, you don't want to use the plugs, but want to use loop tubes. You can. I had to clean all of that up because it comes almost straight from the water jet kind of deal. Uh, cleaned it all up, attached the scales, put the logo on. Uh, I did something different with the logos. I leaned it a little bit to one side on purpose because it kind of, if you look at it, it goes with the flow, the curvature flow of the handle. I just, I don't know, seemed like the right thing to do, so I did it on this one. I got another one in the works that I did a little differently. But anyway, I hope Michael likes this. I'll take some pictures. Uh, one thing I did do, um, he intends to use this a lot. So I gave it the aluminum, what I call a brush finish, if you will. And then I actually left the G10 satin. I didn't polish it up. I got a good sand on it, um, cleaned it up. Got it down to a grit that I liked. And now I just need to wipe it down. Maybe wash it a little if it's got a spot or two on it. Anyway, I'll probably post this in a few days. Take care.